Hello people, Jane and Police Matter here. Today I'm going to show you how to install CIA files to your Nintendo 3DS system using NASA. NASA claims to have a much better boot rate than FBI. And yeah, that's it. So first boot, uh, you need to pass the files to your SD card like you would with, with any app under the 3DS folder. Then boot your Homebrew launcher. I'm using a home menu hacks on 10.3. Put the CIA files, make sure you have enough storage. You're going to need twice as much, I believe. So boot NASA. And there we go. It actually launched on first try, which is pretty good. Let's press select. By pressing select, you actually get access to the uh, file explorer. Go over to the place you have your CIA files. I'm going to, ins to install Super Smash Bros. And it's going to import. I'll be back when it finishes. So as you can see it hasn't uh, finished yet but it's going. And yeah you can tell it's working if you see this. So I'll be right back. Okay I'm done so it's finished. I'm going to quit. Just like um, FBI just hangs on the red screen, so hold your power button. Until it shut down, shuts down. Okay, then turn it on. Yeah, this thing is under the display. It stood there when I disassembled it. So now let it load, I have lots of stuff here, wait. There we go, new software has been added to the menu. Super Smash Brothers. As you can see, whatever. I successfully downloaded and installed Super Smash Bros. Super Smash Bros. Um, is available as a cartridge as well, I also own that. I believe there is an exploit using Super Smash Bros, but I don't know whether it, whether it works or not for the old 3DS, aka the regular 3DS, 2DS systems. So there we go, it loaded. Thank you for watching guys, if you enjoyed this video please click the like button below and subscribe to my channel. See ya!